Tony! Huh? You read my mind. Oh, what? You even lit a fire. I did? Oh, <laughs> yeah, I did. <laughs> Oh, do I? Uh, uh, Pre-marital jitters. Occupational hazard for us bachelors. <laughs> Why wait? <laughs> Why don't we simply move up the wedding date? Well, yeah, that, that, that's a marvelous idea. <laughs> oh, Tony. Wait till I get you in Jamaica. I guess I'll have to. It won't be too long. Tony, can I ask you something? What are we whispering about? <laughs> What do you think you've been doing, Jeannie? Do you really love that one? Well, I, I wouldn't be marrying her if I didn't. Well, if this is what you really want, I will try to serve you and make both of you happy. No, Melissa, is in, you or out. There is just not enough room in my life for both of you. But I take up very little room, and I will make that one happy, too. Oh, boy, that'll be the day. Hi. Hello, Hello. This? Uh, Tony, I just ran into Rock. I want you to meet a very old friend of the family, Grover Caldwell. Oh, how do you do? So you're the lucky man. Liz has told me all about you. Oh, is she? Good. Uh, Grover, tell him the news. Captain, after a long and honorable military career, the department has prevailed upon General Stone to turn in his stars for a pair of striped trousers and an attache case. Turn in his stars? <laughs> That's State Department talk, meaning that Daddy is our newest ambassador. Well, congratulations, sir. That's wonderful news. Thank you, Tony. It's a great opportunity for both of us. Uh, yes, yes, I'm sure it will be. Us. Who do you think he's taking to Europe as his military attaché? Yeah, don't get the idea that it's just because you're going to be the father of my grandchildren that uh, you're getting this plum. I'd have wanted you with me in any case. Well, you people have a lot to talk about, so I'll just pop off and take care of the passports and clearances. Tony? Oh, yes, yes, pleasure. General? Oh, uh, sir, uh... Tony? Don't you think it's wonderful? Well, now, now, slow down, slow down. I can't, uh, I can't quit what I'm doing. It's a great opportunity, Tony. Of course it is. Tony just hasn't had time to think about it. Oh, we can all discuss this at dinner. We are coming to your house for dinner tonight, aren't we? Yes, yes, of course, but there's nothing to discuss, Melissa. I'm in the space program because that's where I want to be. I, I don't mean to sound ungrateful, sir, and I know you'll make a, a wonderful, a fine ambassador. Well, I'll... I'll see you both at seven. Congratulations again, sir. Thank you, Tony. Jeannie? Jeannie? Please, please. Now, Tony. Huh? Excuse me. Mm -hmm. 